Hey guys, Joanna coming in. Got another battle replay for you here on Total War Rome 2. Welcome back to Land of Sieges. This is not part of the 2v2 tournament. This is a regular 2v2 siege. Just wanted to throw that out there right off the bat. We are on the settlement of Kath, which the town center for Kath is way over here. Antioch is in here. Kath, over there. So, all right, let's take a look at the armies. We'll start off first with the defenders. Uh, we have a Galatia here being commanded by Bad Fur Day. And his ally over here is Pontus being commanded by Horizon. So there you go. Bad Fur Day and Horizon. Taking a look at the attackers, though. Uh, first, we will look at Sparta being commanded by Nice Rice 2468. And he has brought six units of Royal Spartans, one of those being the general. Three Spartan youths, two Spartan hoplites, and three Cretan archers. And oh my god, we got a sally out. Okay, we're going to slap. We're going to stop that right there because I don't want to miss anything at all. Wow, that is a lot of Galatian swords. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six Galatian swords and two units of Cappadocian cavalry. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. Uh, second attacking army on the battlefield we do have is Artaverni being commanded by Titledsum. And he has brought seven units of chosen swordsmen, five Celtic warriors, two levy freemen, two Oswan, one of those being the general, and four units of Gallic hunters. But boy, oh boy. Whoo! All right, let's get ready for the beginning of the battle, guys. All right, diving in. Celtic warriors going to take the charge from both units of the Cappadocian cavalry. And there, they're taking some losses. Oh, no, they didn't take any losses. Oh, my God. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What is this? We got some light horse coming out as well. Oh, my God. Galatia coming out strong, getting into these Levy Freeman, and they are getting wrecked. Galatian Swords doing a lot of damage. Cappadocian Cavalry actually passing on by and now getting into the back of this ooh, Celtic Warrior. A lot of losses there, but we do have some Galatian Swords coming quickly over here. Nope, they're done. I think that uh, Celtic Warrior unit's pretty much done. Light Horse coming around for Galatia. They've lost a lot. Zero kills so far. Cappadocians here. Let's see. 15, 73, and 79 with 64 kills. Wow. Really nicely done with the Cavalry Sally out. But back over here. And the Galatian Swords starting to dig in. Let's see. Anything really impressive kill-wise. Let's take a look at this guy here. 105 kills. He's only lost four men. And we have some Levy Freeman up on the wall here for Galatia as well. But Sparta has brought up some of his Spartan Hoplites to try and help his ally out. Brutal start to this battle, guys. Holy crap. I did not expect an infantry and cavalry sally out. That was shocking. My God. Celtic Warriors here. Another unit getting routed off the field. Cappadocians at 97. That unit at 53. Galatian Swords, 29, and we have the Light Horse still over here, only getting two kills so far, but he did use the Frenzy Charge, but he charged into, he chose into Chosen Swordsman. That is not going to be a good go. Not going to be a good go. We got a Javelin Volley. Oh, yeah, a little bit of a Javelin Volley, but again, Cappadocians getting into the back of the Celtic Warriors again. Wow, really nicely done so far with this cavalry, I have to say. Where's the other Cappadocian? He's still sitting over here. Light Horse getting taken out. Yeah, I didn't figure they were going to be around very long, honestly. Six kills. Kind of surprised they even got that many. Uh, but we have some of the Galician Swords now coming on over here. Chosen Swordsman dispatching the Light Horse. Oh, Cappadocia came over here again. Oh, my God. These guys are just straight up being war dogs right now. This Cappadocia Cavalry, 135 kills down to 26. This unit here with 109 kills lost nine men. So far, oh god, bye bye. This Celtic, oh, they're facing the wrong way. Ow. Well, that was a beaten up one anyway. But yeah, they are done. No, stay in there, finish them off. Oh, okay, never mind, they're gone. Wow. 71, 156 kills. That's got to be one of the best Cappadocian cavalry units I've seen in a long, long time. Holy crap, that's crazy. Galatian Swords finally getting taken out over here. 76 kills down to 55 men. They have routed away. Maybe they come back. Maybe they don't. But Cappadocian said, I don't care, man. Cappadocian Cavalry said, I don't care. Both of them charging in over here. Getting into the back of the Royal Spartans. That's a Royal Spartan all the way up here. Oh, my God. I thought that was still the Spartan Hoplites. Joseph Swordsman, 73 kills, 120 men. This unit here, 156 men with 88 kills. Not too bad. 
But that one right there down to 12 with 143, 161. They've lost 17. That's huge. Huge amount of kills. All right, what do we got inside? Some Eastern Spearmen there. Galatian Legionnaires coming up to the front wall here. Oh, we actually have some more still outside here. Galatian uh, Swords still outside. Surrounding a unit of Spartan youth, but we do have another unit coming over here. Levy Freeman going to try and get over here, and yeah, that should be enough. We got Archer Fire coming in, I think, as well. Yeah, we do. Uh, is it Archer Fire? I could have sworn I just saw Archer Fire coming in there. Is that the Archers maybe from on the top here? Yeah, it's 27 kills for that unit. This unit here with 13. Tortoises are back under work, though, or back to work, I should say. This Cappadocian Cavalry is not done. He wants... This is a broke... Well, they're coming back now, but they're dead. They're dead. This Cavalry unit right here wants to break 200 kills. And if he stays in there... That's 62 more Galatian swords. Is he hitting these guys? Where's he going? Why did they run right away? Oh, they're on that team. I'm dumb. Sorry about that. That was a mess up on my part. But nope, they're going to come around, get into this Celtic warrior. It's going to be another 31 men. Oh, they lost a couple more. Down to 60. 166 kills now. But we do have... No, they're not coming over here. I thought the Chosen Swords were going to come over here and help out. But no, they are not. That Celtic Warrior, unfortunately, gone. Another Celtic Warrior getting taken out. I think that's all of them. Yeah, there are no more Celtic Warriors here. So Arverni has taken a pretty big loss. Uh, Sparta lost a little bit, but I don't think he lost much. It was more... All that cavalry was more directed over here towards... Uh, Towards Arverni for sure. How are these guys looking? That's still solid. They only lost one man, 32 kills, but come on, it's World Spartans. Come on now. All right, so we got some of the Gallic Hunters now making their way over here. They actually took some losses from something. I'm not sure exactly what got to them, though. That unit's still full, so it was just this one unit that got hit. They lost 16 men. They do have 41 kills, though. They are making their way across, but oh my god, more infantry coming out. Galatian is are they do you even want to bother defending the settlement or are you just coming? Oh, they're picking off the weaker units Yeah, legionnaires are gonna trash these, these Spartan youths should be pretty quick. It honestly should be very very fast What are they at? 149 148. All right, we'll be back over there in like a minute We'll see if that unit's even still there, but all right over here We have some Spartan hoplites getting inside finally getting inside the settlement this unit oh, almost a hundred needs one more kill Oh, but they are getting hit. They are getting hit hard Celtic Slingers here for Galatia, laying the stone, laying the stone into these Spartan Hoplites. I think this unit, oh, uh, yeah, they're, no, are they going to, no, they're not, no, they're not. Galatian Swords charging in, no, we got some Galatian Legionnaires actually coming across. What is going on here right now? Where is this unit? Hold on a second. Where is this chosen, oh, they're over here. So the Legionnaires are, oh, the Legionnaires are running back too, but they, wow, they, they're losing, losing decisively. 19 kills down to 120. Let's swing back over here. They didn't kill them all. Wow, they're running away. 58 kills, though. I would have stayed over there and just killed it out. I mean, the Royal Spartans are coming over here, but you could have definitely gotten some more kills on that unit. But yeah, so far, Ro uh, Rome. Wow, Sparta's having a difficult time getting inside over here. Spartan Utes taking on the Galatian Swords. That is not going to go well. 180 kills for Galatian Swords. They've lost 33 men. Where is that Cappadocian Cavalry? Did he get back inside? Did that Cappadocian come back inside or is he still out there? Oh, tell me he didn't lose them. No way. Did he lose them? Oh, we got Pontic Swordsman outside. Got some Thoreo Spears right there as well. What an explosion to this battle. Holy crap. All right, so we got some Spartan Hoplites inside. Looks like they're going to try and come around and get into the back of this Galician Swordsman unit. Spartan youth doing their job, I guess, to a degree, holding that Galician Sword unit in place. So here we go. Spartan Hoplite's going to take on that Galatian Sword. Spartan youths are still alive, so they can come in and help. Actually, I think they are kind of helping outside, but we have more Chosen Swordsmen now coming over here. 39 kills down to 139 men. Now, that could be really bad. If these archers over here... Uh-oh. Oh, those are slingers. That's right. Does Pontus have archers? He's got a unit right there. Eastern archers up on the wall. Firing down. Oh, my God. They're firing into the backs of these Chosens. Oh, no. How many kills do they have? 33 kills. Not too bad, but these Chosens are gone. 32 and 52. They got 152 kills. Wow, 222 on that good unit. Nice. That's good stuff. So one unit here with 159. The other unit there walking away with... Let's see what they walked away with. 225. Not bad at all. Now this over here, what happened? Oh, it's an Easter Spearman. Never mind. Okay, I thought it was a Thoreos. 
But back over here, yeah, these Spartan Hoplites, oh no, they are caught. They are caught out. Javelins in the back. Go ahead. Oh, did you throw them already? You threw them all? Oh, how many kills do you have? 64 kills. Okay, not bad kills at all. Galatian Swords here, 225. My God. Oh, Legionnaires getting shot in the back. Yep, 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 yep. Arverni is done. He has lost a lot of his army. Holy crap, Arverni lost a lot of his army. He's down to one, two, three, four units of Chosen Swordsmen, his Osworn, and his four Hunters. He has lost everything else. Wow, that is huge. What does Sparta still have? He's still got his youths. Two of the youths, at least. Royal Spartans, Royal Spartans, Royal Spartans, the General, Royal Spartans. So, yeah. Wow, they have both taken some serious losses. Look at the balance of power right there. We got Slingers over here again. Tossing those stones across into the back of this Chosen Swordsman unit. And they're going to get held up. Oh, no, no, no. We got Royal Spartans coming in. Okay. Royal Spartans going to get in onto the back of this Pontic Swords, and that's going to be big. Oh, they're coming over here. Oh, no, they're coming over here. They're going to get to this Thoreos, but the Thoreos did get some javelins away. A lot of javelins away. I think they might have shot some of their own guys in the back, though. I think they might have, but all right. Back over here, we got Sparta with his three Cretan archers kind of hanging out right here. 42, 28, and 24. We have a unit of Eastern Spearmen that came back. I'm still keeping an eye out for that Cappadocian because I don't know for sure if it's dead. I don't know for sure if it's dead. He could have crossed the river right there and came all the way back around over here and went in the back gate, or the side gate, I should say. So I don't know for sure if he's dead. We don't know if he's dead, but we got the Eastern Archers coming down. Oh, my God, this unit came back from all the way over there. They're coming over and getting a charge in onto the back of the Chosen Swordsman. My God. Galatian Swords, 71 kills. Chosen Swordsman here with 27. They are surrounded. Yeah, not looking good. That unit is having a rough day again. No, don't send more over there. Don't send more over there. That's not... No, don't, don't, don't. No, please go back. Chosen Swordsman, please go back. Oh, God, I think he's going in. This Chosen Swordsman getting eaten alive. 144 kills, though. Pontic Swordsman getting shot in the back as well. So we got archers firing into both units. But I think we had... This got four units of archers firing in onto that over any Chosen Swordsman. Chosen Swords are living. They stayed alive. 42 of them left in the unit. 153 kills. Not bad at all. All right, so back over here. Kind of interested to see what's going to go on. Oh, the Galatian Swords break it, but never mind. What is this? More Thoreos Spears coming up over here for Pontus. Thoreos are going to try and hold back against these Chosen Swords, but it's not going to work out very well. But this Galatian Sword actually did not end up breaking completely. They almost routed away. I thought they were going to route and completely disappear, but they are not. Oh, they're routing again. Thoreos getting over here. We have a Pontic Swords are making his way over here as well. Wow, guys, this is crazy. This is a this is a battle. This is an all-out fight right now. Arverni is really getting torn up. He's got his four archers left. This Chosen Swordsman still holding on. Barely holding on. 32 men, 166 kills. This unit over on this side, he's chewing up those Thoreos right now, which is definitely going to be very good. If he can get inside, that would be even better. But this, uh-oh. Uh-oh. You still have javelins. Oh, no. The Chosens are up on that hill. Oh, that is death. You better start throwing right now, Thoreos. Yeah, oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, God. Not as bad as I thought. Maybe get a little closer. Maybe get a little bit closer. But this Thoreos still holding on. Still holding on. More javelins being thrown. Ten kills so far. Honestly, this Thoreos should probably, like, right over there and just javelin them right in the back. That would be just murder central for that uh, Chosen Sword unit. But he's still holding on. 100 kills. 125, he's actually gotten a couple more. Was that artillery? Is that Galatia? No. Who is that? Pontus. Pontus firing his artillery. Zero kills. Did shoot once. Let's see if he's going to get another shot. Is he going to shoot again? Oh, yeah, he is. He's just firing over here into this blob. Where's the shot? There it is. Oh, yep. Got a little bit into the Spartan Hoplites, but I think he hit a little bit more of the Pontic Swordsman than he did the Spartan Hoplites. But look at this. Cretan Ar archers unloading on this front line right now. Bye-bye, Pontic Swordsman. You're done. You are done. And we have an O-Sworn coming over here now, too. Hopefully going to try and come over here and relieve this Chosen Swords. But he's winning. He is winning the fight currently. Uh, I don't know how well he's going to do, though. We got some Eastern archers there. 
Uh, Eastern Archers honestly should press up a little bit further here, but now with this Osworn getting over here, they might need to send some more infantry. They may just need to send another unit over here, but we have a Thoreo Spear right there. What do we have in the middle? We have another Galatian Legionnaire there. More Galatian Legionnaires over on this side. Balance of power is really not looking good for the attackers, but oh, Sparta found a gap. Royal Spartans have found a gap, but they found a lot of javelins too. They found a ton of javelins. Oh my god. They think they're getting shot by their own guys also. Eastern Archers are trying to run away. We still have the Celtic Slingers sitting right there though. Four Celtic Slingers here and three units of the Eastern Archers all in this front area. Oh, the artillery. If their attackers brought artillery, oh, that would be nasty. That would be tasty right there. In all seriousness, that would be beautiful. Be able to kill a whole bunch of them, but Sparta didn't stop. Hold on a second. How did he do? He bounced off this Legion hair and just kept on going. These Royal Spartans are not done. Look at them. Covered in blood, running as fast as they possibly can. They just got javelined in the back, and they're getting javelined in the back again. But the slingers and archers are running. Thoreos here. Oh, boy. Bye-bye. Yeah. They're still going. They're not wavering. Keep going. Oh, they're dead now. Okay, never mind. I was going to... I thought they had a hope. I really thought they had a hope of getting to at least some of those slingers. But, oh, God. Thoreos again. Tossing those javelins. Bye-bye. Yeah, you're done. 166, though. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right, so we got attackers, got a foothold here. Ooh, we got a general. What is that? Oh, I can't see. Pontic Swordsman General, probably. More than likely, it's a Pontic Swordsman General. Uh, we have not seen the Galatian General yet, though. But they do have more Galatian Legionnaires over there. We actually have a unit of Spartan youths going over there. They're going to chase down those Eastern Spearmen. Good for you, Spartan youths. Go get them. Earn your stripes. Try and become more than just a Spartan youth. All right. Osworn, get... What is that? Oh, that's Thoreos. Osworn getting into some more of the Galatian Legionnaires. The Legionnaires have now turned, so these Cretan archers here are going to be able to get some really great shots. 130. Oh, they're out of ammo. Okay, I was like, why are they all the way up here? Gallic Hunters. 131, 157. Not too bad, but this Legionnaire unit is getting toasted right now. We got some more Chosen Swordsmen. That was the unit that was over there in that breach, and they are still alive. Charging in here now, getting into this... this uh, the Rayo Spear unit, but we still have all of this ranged right here. This is like a kill pocket, a massive kill pocket for the defenders. Be able to get some really good shots in here. Osworn still churning. 225 kills for them. They're going in. Chosen Swordsman still alive. Charging it out to this Galatian Legionnaire unit again. The might of the Barbarians is here. Oh, what is that? We Oh, we got Spartan Youths! Is that a Spartan Youth? It is a Spartan Youth getting around the flank. Oh, never mind. Pontic Swordsman General coming over here. I don't think that Spartan Youth's going to get very far. Oh, they're still going. They're still going. He's trying. He's trying. A lot of the units pass. Keep going. Keep going. Wow, they, they got passed again. My God, they got passed again. I mean, they're dying, but they got past them, and they got into the... No, they didn't. Yeah, they did. They got into the Eastern Archers. But, I mean... It was just funny to see them get around there. Oh, what is that? A Galatian nobleman general coming over here now. Oh, boy. Now they're still going. They are still going. Why are these guys not shooting? They should totally be ble like that. Ouch. There was a lot of ow. Oh, more ow. Oh, God. That was brutal. That was definitely brutal. Spawn use again, though. Still getting in here. Keep running. Eastern Archers, you got to run for your lives, man. Keep going. Oh, no, they broke. How many kills did they get? 12. <laughs> All that running for 12 kills. All right, so we got the Osworn here. Chosen Swordsmen are all gone. Wow. So Arverni has his four units of Archers, 160, 132, 95, and 120, and two Osworn. 320, the General just starting to churn away here. 75 kills. We got Royal Spartans making their way forward. And we still have a Galatian Legionnaire sitting over here, and that's pretty much a full unit. Yeah, he's got 68 kills, only lost seven men. So that's still something. Uh, did Spartan Youth win? Hey, they did. Spartan Youth did something. They killed a bunch of stuff. They killed a bunch of Eastern Spearmen. Good for them. Good for them. What a... Jesus. That was crazy. I still cannot believe that that Cappadocian Cavalry did all that damage. 
One unit, almost 200 kills. And he's still, what did he lose, 20 men? Whoo, boy. All right, so we got some Galatian Legionnaires here. And starts throwing those murder sticks into the Royal Spartans. Royal Spartans are just going to shield up here, going to hop light wall it up. Yeah, those, a lot of those javelins aren't going to really even hit home. Where are they shooting? Oh, they're shooting at the Oswald with the slingers. Okay. Okay. Uh, we got the archers over here. Eastern archers over here. We got the Pontus general. Okay, so he's protecting this flank still. We got more Galatian legionnaires back there. Another full unit of Galatian legionnaires. Oh, my God, guys. This is insane. This is really crazy. Who's firing? Is that still Pontus? Yes, it is. Pontus is firing. Galatia is now firing as well. How many kills? 15. Oh, not good. 24? Okay. I think they're trying to just fire over here. Let's see. Yeah, they are. They're firing over here, getting into the Royal Spartan General. Actually killed. Mm-mm-mm. It's -mm -mm. out of 135. I'm going to fix that aim, though, a little bit there, Galatia. What about you? You are still firing 17 kills. Pontic Swordsman's going to have no problem holding back these Gallic Hunters. But this Osworn over here, he is angry. He's got to be angry. Go. Get him. Murder them all, Osworn. Get them. Avenge your men's lives. Kill them all. Oh, that wasn't good, Gallic Hunter. As soon as I zoom in there. Oh my god, the artillery's still blasting over here. 35 kills now. Galicia here sitting with 61. And the center assault has now stopped. No, there's the other there's other Osworn still here. 345 with this Osworn. Slinger's moving forward. They only have 55 kills. Where are they going? Oh, they have daggers out. Are they out of ammo? Oh my god, they are. Well, that's what happens when you shoot straight onto a unit like that. 105 armor. Don't shoot it in its face. Just don't. Just don't. Wait for opportunities. Like, really wait for opportunities. Like, right now, as these guys are moving forward, these slingers should move over here and fire. Straight in there. They'll be getting just murderous, non-shielded side kills on these Royal Spartans. Oh, wait a second. Royal Spartans over on this side, getting up with some Galatian Legionnaires. More Galatian Legionnaires and another unit of Galatian swords. Holy crap. What were the funds on this? How many Galatian Legion... I'm uh, just Galatian Legion. How many Galatian swords are in this battle? My God. All right, Slingers, are you guys out? No, you still have ammo. You still have ammo. But I don't think this Pontus General is having a good time. No, Pontus Swordsman is not having a good time. He is losing decisively <laughs> against the Osworn. He is angry. I hope he used his headhunt, and I hope he... Does a lot of damage. I really do. Because that other Osworn, I think, is gone. Yep, the other Osworn is gone. Did not end up seeing what the total kill... Oh, there he is. 383. Not bad. Really not bad at all. Oh, Cretan Archers. Four. Sparta firing away, getting into these Celtics. They still have ammo. That unit, at least, still has ammo. Uh, Sparta retreating away. He's going to form a phalanx there. Keep running. Yeah, the... I, I can see it happening. I think the, the Sparta player can see it as well. Galatian Legionnaires looking like they're just going to try and come around and cut that unit off. What these two units should literally still honestly still be doing is chasing this unit down to try and keep them there and let this Legionnaire unit get into the back of them. Is he going to bother? Come, why would you? Spartan youths. Don't even bother. Kill the Royal Spartans. That is much more important to kill than a, than a Spartan youth. Come on, man. Well, all right. Well, we got the uh, Royal Spartan General now charging up over here, getting into these Celtic Slingers. Some of the more of the Gallic Hunters coming up. 150. Osworn General has... Yeah, he's done his job. He has broken this Pontic Swordsman General. He's dead. Pontic Swordsman General is going to be gone very, very soon. General actually just died. So, yeah. Osworn is going to get through. 269. Giggity for the Osworn General. Galatian Nobleman General in the center holding on to these Royal Spartans. 189 for them. Pretty good job. This unit there with 21. They're just getting in there. The general himself, 35. Another Royal Spartan over there with 7. But he's got... Why, wait, why did you pull away? No! No, 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 no. Run. Run. Run, 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 run. Yes, run away. Run. You really need to run away. You will die. Brutally and quickly against the Royal Spartan unit. Galatian swords are good. 
They're not Royal Spartan good. Definitely not Royal Spartan good. All right, so we got the Slingers back over here. They actually might not be a bad idea. Yeah, goes the Galician Legionnaire there. He's coming back towards the center to hold in the middle. But these Slingers right here, honestly... Oh, I think he just saw it. No, Galicia, go in there. Go in the breach. Oh, where are you going? Oh, Galician Legionnaire should have come around over here and blocked that Royal Spartan off. I mean, here comes the Osworn. He's coming back. He's taking some losses, though. 60 men left. No, I'm sorry, 100 men in the left. Take, taking 60 losses. There we go. 285, though. Good kills. Really, really good kills. Cretan Archers. One, whoa. That was at 149 a second ago. 170. Good volley on that one. 116, 130. Royal Spartans breaking in the middle. 199, though. Good amount of kills. What is this? Eastern Archers charging through the through the gap there. Going to get into these Cretans. Now, Cretans are much better in melee than the Eastern Archers. But the Eastern Archers, did, they got through there. They got through there. Yeah, these Slinger... Oh, wait, wait, wait. What are we doing? Galatian lead. Yeah, keep falling back. Just keep falling back. Just keep falling back. Run away. Legionnaires are coming back. Okay. I mean, the center here looks like it's pretty solid for the moment. For the moment, it looks like it's pretty solid. Uh, we actually have some more... No, no, no. Oh, he hit there. Okay, so he's getting into the side of the Galatian Legionnaires there. Legionnaires appear to be doing pretty good, though. This noble general needs to get up here. This nobleman general... Oh, wait a second. Oh, that's Gallic Hunters. Oh, I thought that... Okay, so Gallic Hunters getting into the back of the Galatian Legionnaires there. Are you kidding me? Gal Gallic Hunters are going to help... Br no, okay, they're wavering. I was going to say. Galatia are Gallic Hunters helping break a unit of Galatian Legionnaires. Yeah, this noble general right here, once that archer unit is dead, he needs to form a line right there and just hold as much and as fast and as long as he possibly can. We have Osworn coming back outside, chasing away a Galatian Legionnaire. Javelin volley in the back. Killed a couple, maybe. 285. No, he hasn't killed anybody yet. Still 280. Up oh, there you go. 286. 286. Uh, we have the Royal Spartans over on this side. They are getting Javelin, though. Javelin, Javelin, Javelin. These Slingers, you, why did you stop firing? You still have shots. One Slinger move over there. The other Slinger stay over here and just hammer this Royal Spartan. Oh, Legionnaires again. Javelin Volley. What are you up to? 289. A couple more kills. A couple more kills, but here we go. All right. Osworn's going to come around this way. I think the Le the Swords are going to try and block. These Legionnaires come back. They might be able to kill off that Osworn General. If they're pinched between Galatian Swords and Osworn, I mean, be between Galatian Swords and Legionnaires, that Osworn might not survive. He might not. Galatian Nobleman General pulling away from the line again. Legionnaires, 62. Spartans here with 112. We actually had a Cretan Archer get through, hit through the gap somehow, get into the back of this Legionnaire unit. This is getting close. Balance of power is ticking back up. It's pretty much even now. Pretty much even now. These Slingers, are you out? You are not. Fire! Oh, wait a second. This guy's pulling back. Is he trying to bait the Spartans to move forward? I hope the Spartans don't move forward. If the Spartans move forward, I hope they go this way. Not that way. Because if they go over there, these Slingers are going to murder... Oh, God. Royal Spartans taking more damage. Run, Slingers. Run, 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 run. Run, 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 run. They have a 28 charge bonus. They would... Okay, well, never mind. That Slinger unit's gone. What about you guys? You still have... Yeah, you still have shots. You still have shots. How's the Osworn doing out here? Holding on. Holding on for the moment. He's got Galatian Swords in his back, Galatian Legionnaire in his face. Both of those units are losing slightly. Well, the Legionnaires are losing decisively. The Galatian Swords are losing slightly. But the Osworn here, he just hit his headhunt. Now he's exhausted. Okay, there you go. Second wind. So he did use the headhunt and the battle rhythm. 366 with the Osworn General now. Oh, the Osworn General's dead. Oh, that sucks. Galatian Swords, 34 kills. Legionnaires, 135. These swords need to get back. Get in there. Why are you not fighting? They don't even look like they're in the back of this ocean. Get in there. Help this legionnaire out. Come on. Oh, wait a second. Oh, they pulled away. That's right. They pulled back. Are the artillery out? 69 kills. Looks like he might still have a shot. Pontus is definitely out, though. What did he get? 49 kills. Not bad. Not too bad. Slingers over here. If you have ammo... 
You don't. Oh, no, no. Well, see, that's that's one of the downsides of, of firing into a 105 armor unit. Firing straight into a 105 armor unit. But Sparta's winning over here. Sparta is winning. Galatian Legionnaires only 40, uh, yeah, 49 kills outside. I think the Osborne General, he's still holding on. Still holding on. Galatian Swords look like they finally rejoined the fight, though. This has been brutal. Brutal and bloody. Whoa, whoa. What was that? A little bit of a lag right there. Okay, so here comes the Royal Spartan General, and he is going to stare down a Galatian Noble General. He's running away. Galatian Nobleman General is running away. We had some Cretan Archers charging in here onto some Galatian Legionnaires. I don't think that Cretan Archer unit's going to win. This unit still has ammo? Nope, they just ran out. 172 kills. Oh, the Galatian Nobleman stayed. Go into shield screen. Go into shield screen, and that melee defense will go skyrocketing. Will skyrocket. Nope, he's running away again. I guess that Cappadocian Cavalry got taken out. Unless, dude, if this Cappadoc Cappadocian Cavalry comes out of nowhere and just hammers this general. Oh, don't go that way. Please don't go that way. He's going in there. He thinks that's the town center. The town center's over there. This is Kath. Not Antioch. Ant oh, no. Oh, the Osborne survived. Wow. How many left? 31, 528 kills. That's an Osworn for you, babe. Right there. That's massive. Massive amount of kills. Royal Spartans coming in. What did that unit have? This unit, uh, 85, 246, 171 on the general, and that legionary unit is gone as well. So balance of power has absolutely shifted in favor of the attackers. Look at Galatia. His artillery is wavering. The Pontus one already broke. Where did the Galatian nobleman jump? Oh, he came up here. We got three minutes and 40, 14 seconds left. Let's fast forward. See what happens. Are they coming in here? Or are they going to go down to the town center? Let's see. They're going to the town center. I don't blame them. Go to the town center. Yeah, the Galatian nobleman general is like, yeah, I'm right here. I'm going to defend against nothing because there's nothing there. Where the Osborne General? There he is. Maybe they at least the, the Galatian... Nope. Okay, hold on. Royal Spartan's coming back. The Royal Spartan General's coming back over here to meet up with the uh, Galatian Nobleman General. Right there. 114 melee defense now. They are completely stationary now, though. That they have their uh, the shield screen on. That melee defense is killer. 114. Very nice. Battle rhythm hit. Battle rhythm hoplite. Oh, that's just a hoplite wall. Is this General dead? I don't know. I don't remember if there's a way to check that in, mu in multiplayer battles. I don't think that there is. Yeah, it doesn't say. Galatian Nobleman, though, starting to drop. Rose Spartan General, but he's getting shot by the Arrow Tower. Arrow Tower are still involved in this fight, uh, but they are capturing the town center over here, and there goes Galatia. Okay. Wow, what a battle. I'm just going to fast forward the rest of this out. What a fight. Our Verney ending it with one unit left in the battle. And that general, 530 kills. That, I would I would say that he avenged his fallen brothers for certain. All right, let's take a look at the ending here. All right, so we got Nice Rice playing as Sparta. He was the one that sent the battle replay in. Dude, thank you so much. Huge battle replay. Nice Rice, 2468. Awesome job, bud. 2,028 kills, getting into his Royal Spartans, 225 for the General, 147, 250, 166, 199. Spartan Hoplites, 197, 108. And Spartan Use 56 was the top, but his Archers, 199, 147, 185. Good job with the Archers, but titled some coming in. R. Verney, 2,846 kills. 530 with the General, 383 with the other row sworn. Archers, 155, 210, 132, 169, giggity. Chosen Swords, 168, 161, 225, 173, 159. Celtic Sword, yeah, Celtic Swordsman, they didn't have the chance to get very many kills. 91, 75, and the Levy Freeman there with 33 top. But yeah, look at those. Oh, Sworn. Woo, boy. 
Getting in onto the defenders, we'll take a look first at Horizon playing with Pontus. 1646, 185. There it is, 194 with a Cappadocian and 144. So both of them doing really, really well. Uh, his archers, 124, 105, 97. Oh, he had a Hillman? Yeah, probably not. Yeah, used to spare three. Okay. Pontic Swords in 119, 86. The Reos, 99, and an 86, I guess. And then we have Bad Fur Day with Galatia, 2170, 2170 kills. Galatian Nobleman General, 186. Uh, why? That's a Galatian Swordsman up here for no reason, along with a Legionnaire for no reason. Uh, his Slinger, 69, Giggity, you win. You automatically win everything. Uh, 78, 90, 65. Galatian Legionnaires, 199, 208, 156. And his Galatian Swords, 261, 107, 234, 92. So they did pretty good. The Galatian Swords did pretty good. His Galatian Legionnaires, 3 out of the 5, over 100 kills. So pretty solid. Slingers definitely needed more kills, though. Gotta use those Slingers. Don't shoot. <laughs> Don't shoot Royal Spartans in the face. Just will not work. 105 armor. It's going to take a while to get through there. Really wouldn't take a long time. But that was a that was a fantastic fight. That was brutal. Pretty much from start to finish. Amazing fight. Thank you all four of you guys. Especially Nice Rice for sending it in. But all four of you guys. Great game. Really, really great game. This was awesome. Thank you so much for sending this over. But that is going to be the end here for me on this battle replay. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Share the content around. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Stay safe, and as always, until the next one. Hey, guys. I just wanted to take this opportunity to send a special thanks to my Patreon supporters and my YouTube members. Thank you very much for your continued support. I really appreciate it.